Welcome, everyone, to the Freestyle Cast. I am your host, Matrix Lord 212, and I'm with Jay. Jay's back. Hey! What's up, Scott? Hello, all. Jay, you look like a new man. You lost a lot of freaking weight, man. How much did you lose? I've lost in seven months. I've lost from 420 to 338.2. Jesus! In seven months. Wow. Go you, man. And that's great. because of diabetes. <laughs> diabetes. Oh, man. Diabetes. Metformin makes you lose the weight, man. Oh, wow. What are you drinking? What's that? Uh, it is sugar-free Kool-Aid. Nice. Everything cool. has to be sugar-free. Wow, okay. No, so, my friend Monica bought this phone, I told you. Right. And uh i told her not to do it but she said i'm tired of when we're talking it sounds so bad and i said well that's the phone going dead she right. spent 130 bucks wow damn yeah. that's and awesome. that's that's not just for the phone that's for the phone the activation the one month plan plus a case in case I now, is this a girlfriend yes. okay never mind yes Right. <laughs> anyway, so what have you been up to? Uh, as I told you on the other messenger, I don't know if I've told you, um, but I've been telling everybody. We went to this uh, fox hunt lodge out in the boondocks, and we sang some gospel hymns for these hunters. Wow. So they didn't and shoot the, you then? You sang to no, the <laughs> no. The first group, the main group, everything was peaceful. Everything was great. But as soon as my church group gets up, oh, no. cows moo and the, uh, and the dogs in the pens are howling. Wow. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> so always those smelling. cows and those dogs, man. They yeah. was sm those dogs were smelling them foxes out in the woods. Wow, because th they're they're going out this morning and t uh, tomorrow morning to uh, hunt foxes. Oh, mm -hmm. fox and hounds. Okay. Well, the fox has been uh, getting people's uh, uh, hogs and stuff. Damn, hogs. Yeah, what, the baby pigs? hog. Yeah, the baby pigs and stuff. Pigs. They're eating them, and and the chickens. They're taking them away and having ham. Oh. Okay. I'm, I'm not, I don't really know too much about that. Okay. So they eat, the foxes eat the, the Well, hogs. let's just say they said that uh, uh, the foxes were killing some of their animals. Oh. So, okay. And I asked a few and they said, I think it's chickens. I think it's pigs. I said, okay. So, so the dogs hunt the foxes and kill the mm -hmm. foxes, right? What do they do with foxes? They kill, they cook them, or they? You don't want no, 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 um, no. Oh, I'm sorry, I don't know. They uh, they mount them. They mount them. What does that mean? You, you know, uh, taxidermist stuff. Tax, yeah, taxidermy. Yeah, Norman Bates stuff. Like you like stuffing it. They they stuff them, and some oh, uh, some uh, collect the the tails and put them on caps, and some just collect the fur. They put the tail on caps. Yeah, I, I just like just like raccoons. Yeah. Okay. Um, and they take the fur. What do you do with the fur? Uh, some just take the fur and just I don't know what they do with the rest, but yeah, they'll mm -hmm. take the fur. They make it into a coat or something. Uh, something like that. Oh I don't God. know what. I don't know what wow. to do with it. They just said, I, I like the fur. The other That's one said, cool. uh, I, I stuff mine. And the other <laughs> one going like, I ain't telling you what I do with mine. I said, okay. Wow. Okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. Get her done. Get well, that fox fur and let's put that on your back. No. <laughs> that, made, that made me think. But ding, 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 ding. <laughs> wow. <laughs> so you're singing too, huh? Yeah, my church was, uh, our choir was singing over there. And, and this is the funny part. The lead singer of the first group 
when we get through singing, he asks us, well, what's your group's name? I couldn't help myself. I said, the Shattered Mirror. The Shattered Mirror. <laughs> okay. Because when we first That's started. That's wild, bro. That's wild. When we, when we first started, a wow. lot of the groups, a lot of the members couldn't carry a tune. <laughs> okay, and we weren't we weren't at at sync, you know. Right but now we're we're getting you better. Like we're getting Timberlake really better. Stopped. No, 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 no. Kind of like Ethel Merman. Jesus. <laughs> oh damn. I love Lucy. That's old. Okay. Hmm. Is it live or Memorex? <laughs> Holy shit! A track. Um. Wow. Oh, yeah. So. Oh, and I did my very first YouTube video. You did? Yes. Whoa. Damn. When, when did you put it out? I put it out about seven or so hours ago. Oh, shit. I got to look at that. Yeah, me too. Yeah. What did you talk about? Uh, just 15 seconds of... Uh, oh, so I, I, to... My video was short, too, like 15 seconds. Or whatever Mine was... Uh, it's, it's called Bored to Tears. Oh, I'm I sorry. Look... I saw it, and you know what? I it, almost it grabbed it. you. No, right. I saw it. I almost grabbed you for a cast, but then we went <laughs> out. No, yeah, no, I saw it, and I'm like, oh, I'm going to get, but then I went, I had to go out, so I'm like, oh, But okay. the one on YouTube is a little bit different because I couldn't capture the original that I did the first time, but uh, it wouldn't let me uh, take it off Facebook or, or copy it and put it on you YouTube. Can't take, so. No, no, once you put it up, oh. no. When I, I first did... When I first did my video, I did it on YouTube and Facebook. Mm -hmm. And I mm -hmm. think YouTube was first, and then Facebook was second. Right. And then, you know, and they were my first videos. And then, um, you know, once it's Facebook, Facebook is Facebook. You yeah, can't get yeah. it off Facebook. You can't, copy, can't do nothing with it. So, okay. That's better than what the, the guy uh, got caught uh, killing, I uh, think, dogs. Why? Uh, these two guys, they uh, they YouTubed and Facebooked uh, killing a dog. Oh, come on, dude. I don't he, Really? Here. Here. No, no, in no, no. Here oh, in Boston. No, yeah. no, no, no. They're trying, they're no, trying them and everything. And I was yelling at freaking Daniel when he was screaming at his dog. Yeah, I wanted, yeah. To, I wanted, I wanted to, to beat his ass. ass. I wanted to come through the damn camera and stuff it. Uh, Smack the shit. No, excuse me, Daniel. I'm sorry, but like I, I just like poor dog was like wanting to play. And he's like, Jab! I'm like, oh man, okay. we're in the this cast. It's like wow. We we had people from California. We had people from Texas. We had people from Oklahoma and Arkansas coming to Bastrop, rallying around the courthouse square. Kill him! Kill him! Wow. I, I'm surprised I'm not there. Whatever yeah. you do, do an, if, if, whatever you do to torture an animal, I, my person. Oh yeah, on YouTube, it's look it up. You son of a bitch! Wow. YouTube didn't take it down. I don't like that shit at all. Yeah. Definitely not. Oh, have y'all seen the new Patrick Stewart uh, YouTube video? No, no, no. This this guy put on a, a video of something that was on the internet or something of uh, Patrick Stewart singing country music. Oh, yes, shit. I did see it. I yeah? did see it. Good. Yeah. Oh my God! I sat there and I laughed my ass off. Oh, oh shit! My butt off. Oh my God! I, really? Because he's doing it. Because if I remember right, he's doing it in his uh, his next generation outfit. Is he? He wore yeah. it. He's wearing, he's wearing his no. next generation outfit, and you think he's going to do this whole uh, make it so thing, and then he stands up and just starts going going to town singing. How's he looking in next generation? Now in this in this video, he doesn't have his uniform on. Okay, he's he's, he's all dressed. He's remember. all dressed in uh, Western outfits, singing okay. uh, El El uh, El Paso. Uh, okay, it must have been a oh, different one. Yeah. Him and his wife are singing. Uh, uh, I'm an old cow Han. Oh shit! Yeah. Wow, I got to send me that stuff, man. Yeah. I got to see that. Yeah. So yeah. today is the anniversary of. Sorrow Your Separation, my first book. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. I can't even show it to you because it's sold out. <laughs> what? So, yeah, I don't, have, I don't have any now. So, Hallelujah. Well, yeah, I do want one to show, though. So now i got to get more. But 
Um, it's basically the anniversary of the whole project, really, because Star was the first book. So we're celebrating all the books today, really, because yeah. without the first book, there would be no book 12. You know, so, you know, calling people out there. If you're interested, today's the day. Show support. Buy my books online. Amazon, Barnes & Noble, wherever. This is the 12th book. Perfect wish. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And just, you know, show your support or, you know, if you're interested in my next book, let me know. I mean, I got a, a funny one. I got a funny one for you. Me and Monica are at the, a coffee shop. And uh, this is uh, mostly not a coffee shop. It, they sell coffee and stuff, but it's like you can bring your books and read and stuff. Oh, okay. And this lady was reading one of your books. And I said, I know this guy. I know this guy. And she, she said, he's a good author. Well, her husband looks at her and says, who the hell is Joseph Caprici Casso? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. I said, don't worry about it, dude. I can't pronounce the last name either. We just call him Matrix Lord. That's it. That That's, right. That's right. <laughs> That's right. Is that a Starbucks drink? <laughs> is it a cappuccino? Is that how we say his name? Yeah. I said he's Italian. Italian, yeah, exactly. He's Italian. I like when you tell me these stories because it's like there's some place on earth that's a coffee shop with people talking about me um, in a positive way and I, i'm like that's great yeah I, that's like a sitcom i love that there was uh, you told me before a, somebody was talking about my book yeah well there's a bookstore in arkansas that's got a blown up uh picture of your uh, the blue cover they, what do you mean they, they blew up a, a, they made a poster it's it's selling good Apparently, it's news to me. Wow, I, I'm blocked out from seeing it for like four months, and so I won't those, know. It's one of those. Uh, we are featuring this book for the week. Dude, you gotta month, take you know? take a picture so you, you can see these. Things. I had an old, I had an old phone that the camera. Oh, remember, I was gonna drop my. Have phone, somebody the set, camera listen, broke. You know what? Find out that here's the thing. If I have that much fans over in that coffee shop. I'll yeah. send them some stuff. <laughs> that, that yeah. I'll send them some books, and they can have more stuff to read. You know, free of charge. Mm -hmm. I I love my fans. I I, would, I, told, I, want I told her to go to um. Uh, what did I tell her? I think I told her Which? to go to your site on the internet and find the book that she wanted, and you would possibly go to find the it Facebook. For her. Go to my Facebook page. Okay. Matrix Lord 212. And send me, yeah. or she could, listen, through you, you can mm -hmm. get me the information mm -hmm. and I'll send it to them. But like the coffee shop, I really, if, I, if they're not much fans of me, I want to support them. And I want, I, I really am happy about that. I really I don't want know about the coffee shop, but the woman was reading your book. I really like that, man. Because you said there was multiple people in that coffee shop that was reading my book. So which one well, was no, the perfect? It, it, was, it, was, it was just her uh -huh. with the book. Okay. And her husband is the one that said, who the hell is that? Right, who is that freaking yeah. the cap yeah. cap yeah, exactly. But, okay. So yeah. Perfect Wish was she reading or Promised yeah. Dream? A Perfect the, Wish. The bluish one. Perfect Wish, okay. Perfect. Yeah. Because well, I don't know a, the title. couple of Okay, there's a couple yeah. of them. All right, but okay. I told her that you were still writing and uh, that uh, there was a new one coming out uh, in the future. Yes, I mean, here's the she thing. Just, she did this, uh, uh, what you call it, uh, oh, who was it? Uh, Eddie Murphy in uh, uh, as a, a black woman in Nutty Professor, and she's just going, ah! <laughs> when I told her that. <laughs> okay. So this is a perfect opportunity now because I said I was going to make a book announcement um, for me to make this announcement. So yes, there is, here's the thing. I am in the process of rewriting tomorrow song five, which is the sequel to perfect wish. Okay. 
I'm in the process of writing the follow-up to this. It's in the rewrite stage. I'm redoing it. It's going to be delayed, unfortunately. But I am mm -hmm. working on the sequel to this. Point of View is the book. Now, also, what you don't know is I am doing another book in the Sorrow series which I dub it as Sorrow Separation X, which is like the 10th book. It's not yeah. going to be called Sorrow yeah. Separation X. It's going to be called something entirely different. Yeah. And I'm this also... Yeah, and I'm also interested in spinning off another one of my books into a series. Winds of Change will be the next one to get a series. So I'm kind of working on three things at mm -hmm. the same time, mm -hmm. plus... Damn. A collaboration, which is not to be confused with right. my book. So in other words, right. the collaboration, I don't count as a book of mine because it's not <clears> mine. <throat> I'm right. helping a friend. So I feel it's hers, even though I'm writing it. So when we have it in order, it will be like Joseph J. Capitoso right. has 13, 14, 15 books plus a collaboration. Yeah. That's what I feel. So I am working on a total of four books. Right. Three are mine and one's not mine right now. I wish um, Lifetime or Sci-Fi Channel or whatever is the genre of your books. I wish Network would make some movies out of these books. It could be. Now, one, the, the Sorrow Separation X. Hey, Marvel could do it. Yeah, right. <laughs> Star Separation X is, is a very, very special project for me. Mm -hmm. This book was many years in the making, and right. the title is hidden in the Destiny's Colon book on the cover. Um, <clears throat> so there have been covers that have been on there, that, uh, whether it be the front or the back, that the books mm -hmm. have not come out yet. Mm -hmm. So it's always been since... The first one, I've had a plan, an overall plan of what books they're going to be or whatever. And it's just due to whether it be finances or whatever, not able to empty out the laptop of all the manuscripts that I have. There is basically in my laptop seven right now. No, I'm sorry, eight. Eight manuscripts not done. Mm -hmm. But I am actually transferring and getting three of them done. So mm -hmm. then the synopsis is for other ones. So there, this book project of mine, when all is said and done, not that I'm done, but I do see myself putting out over 20 books. Now we're at 12 right now. In the future, I will probably have 20 plus, and that's fine. Mm -hmm. It's just all about the finances because it costs me money. Now, I'm not going to do a book if I have a lot of bills. So what I would do is I would pay my bills off first where I wouldn't have anything outstanding that would get in the way of the project. Right. And when all of them are wiped, which will be soon if I really have to get this book done, yeah. um, everything will be wiped where I would have no room for error, nothing going on, and then I would do the book. I really want to get one book out before the end of the year, <clears throat> and I do want to get two books out. Right. Maybe – well, actually, more than likely – Point of view will be out before December end. And the collaboration will also be out. So I probably will have two books out this year. Okay? Right, right. My other books, 2019 will probably be the crazy year where I put out more than two. And I'll be like the olden days where I put out like four or five in one year. It's going to get crazy in 2019. So... Hopefully by 2020, I will have a total of over 20 books out, not cap counting the collaboration. By May 5th, 2020, that is the goal that I have 20 books out by right. May 5th, 2020. That hmm. is the goal. Um, we're at 12 right now. and we're, yeah. we're, So we got two years, two years yeah. to pop out seven books plus a collaboration. So that's I don't mean goal. to change the subject, but how are you, Scott? Pardon? I didn't hear you. What? I said, how are you? I'm doing great. Uh, I went and saw uh, Quiet Place, quiet, quiet place, which was quite awesome. And I, t I texted uh, 
Joe here. I didn't give him any spoilers. I just said this is how what way they portrayed the monsters in this was mm-hmm. the way which they should do in all of them. So, right. and I've seen you can pass on. You should wait for TV or video for uh, what was it? Oh, uh, to tell the truth. I mean, uh, truth or dare. Yeah, that was. I'm gonna wait to rent. To, rent to, I'm gonna yeah, do that on the That day. just that to me that. That show went yeah. straight to Netflix. Right. I still got to watch the new Hellraiser, which I I didn't order yeah, yet. Same, yeah. yeah, I'm not sure if I want to order it or not. Have you been watching TV, Jay? Uh, no. Uh, I'm still not able to get to uh, watch any more Doctor Who right now. I uh, I've got to find. Anyway. I got to find. Uh, well, I mean the past ones. Mm-hmm. I can't watch them because the watch series is not doing uh, it. There's something wrong with watch series, okay. uh, and I'm trying to find a new uh, link, okay, to try to get to that. But since I haven't been able to watch any of those, I th- I'm thinking about waiting until the season finale of every show that I've been watching and just catch up, so I have something to watch this summer. Okay, um, I'm loving uh, Timeless. Oh, me too. I've yeah. yeah. That's that's one of my new. I'm loving the fact that it's on its second season, and mm-hmm. yes, yeah. and the way they're going with it is spot on. But I still mm-hmm. think that was a test, which the one dude did with uh, the one gal. I mm-hmm. still don't think that was a test. And I've been watching uh, on YouTube uh, the old nineteen. 19- no, 2000s, uh, uh, 2007, 2008, something like that, uh, Nero Wolf. Mm. And then when I got through with it, because there was only two seasons, I'm fixing to be finished with watching 1975, I think it's 75, Ellery Queen Ooh. with Jim Hutton. I saw a couple that, of those episodes. That is the father of Tim Hutton. Yep. That played Archie and Nero Wolf. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I love Ellery Queen. I wish they had done more of it. They've got. They've actually got. There's a site that I go to, which is like a old radio programs, mm-hmm. and they and they and those are one. Of, and they do old Ellery Queens. They do mm-hmm. the Shadow Green Lone Ranger. Yeah, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Gunsmoke even. Oh, God, I can't stand guns. No, you don't like it? Uh-uh. uh-uh. It's like the Waltons, Little House on the Frickin' Prairie. It's the same thing every week. <laughs> <sighs> Our oh. teacher, we go to school, and the teacher would ask us the next day, well, what did you watch on TV last night? Little House on the Frickin' Prairie. Oh, my God. Wow. We were forced to watch it because... Back then, you only had three stations, and mm-hmm. my daddy controlled the TV. Yeah. Wow. Uh, good night, Elizabeth. Good night, uh, Grandma. Good night, Grandpa. Good night, John. Boy. Shut up. Oh, God. Wow. Every I single I got night. Done saying good night and good morning. I'm surprised it wasn't the next day. All right. We're going to be back in a few minutes. Thank you, Jay. <laughs> Thank you, Scott. <laughs> I appreciate you guys supporting me with my book project. And yes, more books are coming. All right? Anytime. Thank you, guys. Take care. Bye for now.